The first thing I do when I'm world building for my books is I focus on the society. I ask myself, how does the society, how do the rulers in the society, the people in power, how do they treat the people below them? How do they treat the poor? This will tell me right away whether or not this is a society that's going to be kind and generous. Is it going to be like utopian or is this going to be a society where it's ruled by like a tyrant? Furthermore, I ask who is in power and why? Um, and what type of power do they have? Is it like a monarchy with like kings or is it like an oligarchy where you have like companies running the country? Who is in power and why? Furthermore, I ask myself if there's going to be a magical system or if not, and if they have some sort of faith or religious system and how that connects potentially to their magic, potentially to their ruler. Do they, do they um, like worship their ruler, for example? Something that's really important when you're world building, particularly if it's science fiction or fantasy and you have magic or advanced technology, make sure that there are rules and limits to your magic. There shouldn't be a spell that solves everything. There shouldn't always be a technological device that solves every conflict. If you are going to be writing a fantasy story that has kings and queens and knights, you really do need to ask yourself what makes yours unique because there are tons of stories with those. Thank you for the great question. If you liked my video today, follow for more.